In MSU's nationally recognized equine science program, students learn about horses, themselves, and the culture of the West. This is Kid over here, and he's one of our equitation horses. And Kid gets used primarily in the beginner classes. He's one that's very sweet to people. He's, in, he's higher in the pecking order in the herd, but um, with people he's generally pretty willing to try whatever they ask him. The benefits that students get from having the horses here are they can come in, most of them, even if they have a horse, can't afford to bring it to school with them. And the students can then use these horses in classes, and many students come in from you know, all over the country and other countries. And they're in Montana and they get to learn how to ride. Sweet Pea is, she's also a sweetheart. She has a little more pep to her than Kid has maybe, but she's also one that is easy to get along with for students. Because uh, MSU is in Montana and there's a, a mostly Western riding in this state, this offers students the opportunity, even students from the East Coast, an opportunity to ride western. Horses teach people things about themselves um, that either they didn't know or that they find out and that they want to change and that horses help them change things about themselves. Horses, um, horses are symbolic and iconic um, and especially in the West. It, it, I think the, the Mustang symbolizes freedom and, and majesty in the American West and I think students are drawn to the West because it symbolizes freedom, the open spaces, the mountains, the clean air. Uh, we have this, I think, unique type of lifestyle um, that's relatively conservative, not, complete, not politically speaking, but the lifestyle of, of conservation. We conserve our uh, environmental features. We use uh, the lifestyle of horses and nature and farming. And I think students are drawn to that, that not only the wide open spaces, but the history uh, of the American West and the cowboy. Uh, and, and we try to preserve some of that and add, or a lot of that, and then add some of the modern uh, equitation uh, with that.